A command inside of Illustrator gives you the ability to clean up any rogue elements within your document. A rogue element is an element that exists, but you don't know that it exists. And this oftentimes can happen if you're trying to create some artwork and you forget to apply an appearance. And new users typically will just kind of forget that they created that object and will start all over again. What I mean by that is, if I come over and choose the line tool, and you'll notice right now with the line tool, I don't have a fill color or a stroke color. And you'll also notice I'm working with postcard cleanup.ai, which is inside your exercise files folder. If I were to come over and click and drag out a line, after drawing out that line, if I press the V key on the keyboard and click away from it, you'll notice it's invisible. What I need to do is come over and select it, and after selecting it, I could then apply some type of an appearance to it. But like I said, oftentimes new users will just dismiss that and click away from it thinking, that nothing's there. The problem with these rogue elements is you oftentimes can corrupt your documents because of them if you have enough rogue elements. So you do want to be careful. Additionally, if you choose something like the type tool, and with the type tool you have a specific font selected. If I come over to the paragraph panel, for example, right now I have this font selected. If I click, and after clicking, I decide I'm not going to add any text, and I choose the selection tool. Again, visually, it doesn't look like I have anything there, but what I really have there is a text element. If I were to save this document and send it off to someone else, if they didn't have that font, they would then have mapping issues for no reason, because that font's not even being used within the document. So how can you find these rogue elements? Well, there's a couple different ways. The manual way, I suppose, is to come up to the View menu, and from there you can choose Outline. Command-Y or Control-Y is the keyboard shortcut. When you do that, you can see all of your rogue elements. We have one here. We have a box here. We have a point here, which is really a text element. We also have a line here. So we have a lot going on here. Certainly, you can select it and press Delete or Backspace to get rid of it. But an easier, more automated way to find these rogue elements is to use the cleanup command inside of Illustrator. So let's return back to the preview view. Command Y or Control Y is the keyboard shortcut to do that. What you can then do is come up to the object menu. You'll notice I don't have anything selected. And under the object menu, you can choose path. And from there, you can choose cleanup. That's going to open up a dialog box asking you what you want deleted, stray points, unpainted objects, and empty text paths. That makes sense. I'm going to leave all those options selected, and I'll click OK. Again, it doesn't look like anything has changed visually, but if we come up to the View menu again and choose Outline, we can see that all those rogue elements were removed. Again, rogue elements can cause your files to become corrupted, which obviously is a very bad thing. So I just wanted to make you aware of that, because oftentimes new users will leave unpainted or unstyled elements within their document. And obviously, that's not something that you want.